Now me and Tim are on our way to pick up a seed cleaner, my seed cleaner. I lent it to a friend and, well, we need to go pick it up because I need to clean this rye seed. Right, Tim? Yes. Yeah, right. Oh, any cars coming? Whammo, into an accident. So anyway, we just put the ball on the hitch, which I didn't think I had one. I had to find a crazy little nut. Uh, really isn't the right one or the right size, but it'll do to go get this thing. So, uh, we're just going to head on up the road here and pick up the seat cleaner. Got to find it first. It's at his farm. So, I'll see you then. Jack stand. Okay. What do you got, Tim? Nothing. Okay. Got the seat cleaner hooked up. Yeah. It's all... I don't remember. I think this just sits in there. Yeah. I put it in there. And it does. It just sits in there. So, anyway... They kind of modified it here. They put a new auger under the end, which really helped out a lot. I'm actually quite appreciative of it. I put a little motor on there, and uh, it should be good. Yeah, and it is fastened up at the top, so that don't rock back and forth. Uh, the air and the tires will check. We just got to make sure Timothy gets his ass over here and make sure I do not hit these little tracks, right? Um, when we get it pulled out of here, I want to pull these. Well, here, I'll do it right now. That's my extra belting for the this little link belt stuff. It works really well. All right, Tim, you just tell me to stop if I'm going to hit that, okay? Right. Well, it's home. Right, Tim? Yes. Look, uh, I don't know. I must have... Uh... Shorted. Oh, 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 I think my wire must have been hanging. It got ripped off. Oh well, such is life. That is 220. Yeah, it's working. Yep, looks good. Everything looks pretty okay. What the heck is that? Is that something? That... Was that a four wheeler going down the road? Motorcycle? It's a it's a motor and a bike. A what? It's a motorcycle and a dirt bike. At this yeah, yeah, yeah. One of those things. Motorbike. All right, so yeah, that must have that belt must have broke off of there, and they put that on. <laughs> Seemed to work okay though. Um, the one thing that we did notice with it here, watch out, Tim. The one thing I did notice with it was the yeah, they did put a strip of metal there, or wood there. Uh, was it was rubbing, and it is still rubbing. Oh, wait, that ain't right. Yeah, right there. It was rubbing. Go ahead, Tim, work it. It's rubbing the wood there, so I'm going to have to figure something out as to why that thing is tracking funny. Um, I'm thinking that maybe it's these. These here have moved over, but I don't know. I know there's something, I, there's something with it. I remember once already I've had to yeah, it's got to be what it is. The whole thing has moved. Well, it looks like they look... Yeah, so what I'll have to do, actually, is loosen up these two bolts, this one and this one, and those two over there, and slide this shaft that way, because you can see, when I do that, it doesn't rub anymore. So that's what we're going to do to it. Um, not today, but I do remember it was something like that. Uh, we'll do that, and uh, we'll get to using this thing here in the next few days. But for right now, I just figured it would be an overview. Now, Dingbat there just knocked the belt off. Dingbat. Wow. This is how old this thing is. It was patented July 10th, 1879. Uh, reissued August 5th, 1879. Patent, patented November 15th, 1892. Uh, 1902 and VAR patented August, I think that's 5th. 18, 1917 so we're looking at a machine that's probably close to 100 years old uh, works very well very very well a few modifications to it because I couldn't get parts for it but uh, I could get parts for it but they were the wrong size because this one is older than what most farms or most seed cleaners use or traditional seed cleaners uh, you can see here in my mess of a shed or building here all the screens for those. Uh, there's over 80 screens there. 
I got some stashed back here. These are the ones that I use for, for soybeans. Um, they're in there. Uh, there's more of them there too. So I'm well equipped in the screen department. In the screen department. So uh, when we do get started with this, we'll pick and choose the right ones to do the job. I've, I've even got seed cleaner screens for asparagus. I know that for a fact because I saw it. Really? Yeah, really, asparagus. So anyway, uh, that's it for this video uh, until we get her running again. Thanks for watching.